Hey there everyone, Alan Blame Gamer here coming at you with a brand new game and a, hopefully a brand new series. This is a game that I've been looking forward to for so, so long. I do. I am going to apologize in advance though because I'm not going to be able to be as excited as I normally am because I'm recording this at 1.30 in the morning. It's because I love you guys so much that I did this as soon as I got off from work. So we're going to start a new game. First, we're going to go to the options and make sure that we have subtitles en enabled and graphic content enabled. Hell yes. What do we have for graphics here? Uh, screen, nah. Brightness, nah. Okay, whatever. So we got that. Let's start a new game, guys. Um, can you guys see that in the recording? I can. And... Be honest guys i haven't played a survival horror game in a long time so we're gonna go with casual for the weak and fearful because that's exactly what i am and that's what i'm going to be known as all right so i don't know if you guys have been keeping up with this game but this game is the uh oh, i can't remember his name but he's the guy who brought us the great game resident evil 4 and uh he's saying that this game here is supposed to bring it back to what resident evil was at its roots but it's a completely new IP, and I'm looking forward to it like crazy. All units, all units, Thought looks a little reminiscent of old Resident Evil games. Why would I skip the cutscene? Sorry, detectives. I know you're just coming off a case, but I'm afraid detour. we're gonna have to make a detour. Sounds serious. Hmm. Is it a riot? What is that profile thing in the top right with a little arrow so pointing down? Homicides. Half a dozen squishing it. Already is that a seen. piece of a brain? Or is that like a nail going into my brain? I don't, so I don't really know. A little happened. confused there. Some patients disappeared. What Some I don't like is the delay in my Still capture program. Gives you the creeps that my screen. Joseph, you think there's a connection? Records were sealed. It's a possibility. I believe the records were sealed. Anyone on scene respond. Castellanos. Dispatch, this is Detective Castellanos in 184. What's the situation? Sounds like Castellaneta, who's the amazing voice of... You guys know? Leave a comment in the section below. Is there any... You know who, the who Dan Castellaneta voice? God damn it! Jesus! Okay. I have the volume turned way down on my TV because I don't want it to conflict with the audio on my microphone because it is very very sensitive microphone which I do love but that's why I really turned on the subtitles here so I can enjoy a little bit of the storyline. Don't know who anybody is really but I'm sure I'm sure we'll they're know everything as we get there. It's a survival horror game. We can't have team members in a survival horror game. It's raining. That guy is the character that we're gonna play as probably because Best designed. So what do we got going on here? We're gonna learn some controls, I bet. I like his trench coat. It's pretty fucking sweet. Sweet five o'clock shadow he's got going. What do you on make too. of it? Connolly, contact dispatch and let them know what's happening. Joseph, Kidman. Kidman, you're with me. Nicole. We're gonna have a look around. Right. Fairly excited. Ooh, guys, I'm so excited. I can't. I've been waiting to play this game since I heard about it. And the cool thing is, it's Bethesda develop the game so let's see what do we we can run around third person i can run oh man this is fucking amazing uh third person can i switch camera angles like i could in resident evil no not so far so can i, can I why are we why are we here why do we not have backup clearly there are a bunch of people here that are not here anymore so this is obviously not hey where'd my team members they are very slow Whatever. Fuck you guys. I'm gonna walk headfirst into what is most certainly going to be our demise. Cutscene as I open the door, because I couldn't do it myself. Maybe it smells in there? Oh, smells, it smells like, blood. like blood. What does blood smell like? Oh, I'll right. pull out that pistol. Stay I sharp. love his gloves. I don't know why he's wearing leather gloves. It's pretty sweet. We're gonna check it out. Don't let anyone else through Yeah, don't let anyone else through the door. I can be an door. extra set of eyes. We don't know what's happening. You're our backup. Some You're dumb backup. broad. Okay, cool. We can't have real backup. So it's a mental hospital. So we all know that amazing things. Oh, look at that. Can I, like, walk through the blood? Do it leaves bloody footprints? Nope. 
Bethesda, what are you fucking doing? Oh my god. Did you hear what something? happened to you, sir? Is it always going to be played in this, like, windowed mode? It's kind of annoying, actually, right now. Someone, Someone alive. alive here. Hey. No, you're not alive. You just fell over. Lied to me. What about over here? What's going on? Hey, lady. You guys have had a bad day. What's going on in here? Are you injured? What happened here? Can't, can't be, be real. real. Can't be real. Impossible. Rubik is. Rubik. Oh, he's dead. I've got him. The security, security cameras, cameras might of tell course. us. Of course. Let's check the security cameras, and we'll let something sneak up on us from behind. That's exactly what I would do. So, what do we got going on here? Uh, so far, I haven't had to hit any buttons except just moving around. So this is a live feed, so what's going on? Cops are shooting people. And, um, uh, okay. Because that's normal. What the hell? Hey, what's up, bro? Oh, he can teleport. That is super... Oh, hey! Alright, because I was totally expecting that. Something tells me we're not going to like where we wake up. Or maybe we're dead. Maybe the game's over. Oh, wait. Nope. We're alive. Upside down. Oh, a little rat. Little mousey mouse. But we're upside down. What do we got going on here? Oh. Okay, so I recognize this. You guys might recognize this, too. This is from the uh, gameplay footage that was shown to us at, I think it was E3. Oh, hey. You look very friendly. Are you friendly? You look for Oh, hey, where are you going? Oh, cat, come on. Right stick. What are you doing? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Ooh, God. Feel bad, feel bad for that guy. Glad it's not me, though. That can't happen to me. I'm the main character. I can't die yet. I have to wait until my actions kill my kill me. What did he just do? Did he just, like, cut somebody in half? Did he? Did he just cut somebody in half? He did. He cut somebody in half. Seems unnecessary to me. Okay, so I can swing. And I want to grab this knife. Because it's glinting in the moonlight here. Can I, how do I grab it? Oh. Almost. <laughs> Nothing I like more than this. There we go. All right, so now they got the knife. Clearly gonna cut myself free. Ow, that hurt. But it's okay. Oh, they took my sweet ass trench coat. What the fuck? I like that trench coat. That's not fair. It's not fair at all. Okay, so what do we gotta do? Am I ever gonna get out of this, like, hang on. Options, graphics. Let's see, um, graphic content, no, enable, enable, why would, why is graphic content, if this is graphic content disabled, I don't know what the fuck is enabled, um, okay, I guess it's gonna stay this way, uh, how do I, okay, so I can crouch and sneak, okay, so something tells me I wanna go away. But I don't know if the game is going to constantly be played in this letterbox mode. Um, okay, so I can't open that door, so I need a key. Locked shut. So far, I kind of like it, because it's not really... What is this profile thing? That's probably what's causing the... Like, letterboxing. Um, oh, hey. Excuse me there. Don't mind me. I see a key, and I'd like to get it. So let's see if we can break this key here. Don't mind me, sir. Excuse me. It's probably not the way I was supposed to complete that task, but it worked anyway. Yeah, I bet I was supposed to wait until he was gone, but... <laughs> 
All right, so we got a key, and we can go through this door. We'll do it silently, though. Don't want to alert him to our presence. Do we want to be able to escape? How do I run? Is there a run button? I'd like to run. I'd like to run, please. Checkpoint. Thank you. So, can I run? What is that on the ground? Is that a tripwire? That's a tripwire. Is there a way I can avoid it? Probably not. Of course not. Surprise, motherfucker! That's not good. Okay, so I just need to run, run, run like a little motherfucker. It's, it's even more terrifying because I know it's back there and I go. Oh, ow! Well, I guess I didn't need that leg. Oh. Well, he can't get to me now. Oh. But that seems to be perfectly fine. Are those closing in? Who would make this? Adorably disgusting. Oh my god. Who is gonna pay for my drive? Oh god, I, oh, I'm swimming in it. Oh dear god. That is just disturbing. And I just got cut too. Now I got a bunch of people's blood in my cu Oh, this is just terrible. Can I still sneak? Okay. Climb this ladder here. And I'm probably going to be limping around for a while. Where am I? Okay, I'll go through there. Go through that door. I don't got to keep an eye on the recording time here, though, because I don't want to go over a limit here. Well, not that there is an actual limit, but I don't want to record for too long. So, what we got? All right, let's hobble over here. Hobble over here. I'm in the sewers. This is just what I wanted to do. I wonder if there are collectibles in this game. I'm sure there are. And I'm sure there was a collectible down there that I probably should have gone to collect, but I can't be bothered to right now. I'll do that in a playthrough where I'm not recording and trying to be entertaining. I do have a complex, though, especially with survival horror games, that I can't seem to not... I'm going to try and go through this door. It's, it's coming out right now, but... I can't seem to not try to complete everything. So is there anything here? Can I sit in this chair? No? Okay, so why was this door here? Okay, cool. Okay. But I can't seem to not... With survival horror games, I really, really, really like to complete them completely, because it, it's just one of the things. Where's the exit? Where's exactly. the exit? What are you doing? Can I steal your... Old note from sewer. Beside the lockade at the far end of the sewer, there is a ladder which would take you to the old ward. If you could make it through there, you would find an elevator leading outside. You would be the one who escaped. You might be the one who survived. Sounds like a plan. So we need to go... Not through that door, because there's probably nothing in there. Oh, god damn it! I can't. Gotta do it. I gotta check the door. Gotta check the door. Survival horror, check the door 101. Okay, so I can't go through that door. All right. That's, that's Survival Horror 101. Check every door, check every room. Oh, there's barbed wire. Can't get through there, clearly. Can't get through there, so I gotta go through here. Normal people don't barricade themselves with barbed wire, do they? Or like barricade rooms, that just doesn't seem normal. Let's go up this ladder here. And I'm gonna go really slow. I can't see what is above me. And I really, really need to find out if it's going to constantly be played in this letterbox style. But I am coming up on 15 minutes here, so I'm going to cut the video here. In the next episode, we're going to continue a little bit farther into what is, I'm sure, going to be one of the best games to come out this year. And I hope you guys will join me in that epic quest. So thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, become a member of the Lame Army today. And I hope you guys, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.